Hey guys, Funk Roberts here with my amazing, beautiful wife, Angela. And today we've got an awesome workout for you. This is our drop set decimator using the metabolic protocol, which means dumbbells, building muscle, burning fat. That's what we're gonna do today. And I'm really, really excited. Now get your dumbbells ready because like I said, this is a 30 minute dumbbell drop set. So what we're doing here is we're gonna be moving from exercise to exercise, 30 seconds of work each exercise, trying to get as many reps as possible, but we're using drop sets. So there's gonna be 15 different drop sets each drop set is gonna focus on a body part. So of course we start with the glutes, we go to squats, lunges, etc. You're gonna do three exercises per drop set. Starting off with dumbbells, then you may drop a dumbbell, and then we may do body parts. So, and then we get that 30 second rest to recoup, to recover, and we move on, all right? So this is a great workout. You would do this once a week. That's it, you don't do this more than once. You would use other workouts in between, all right? So guys, grab your dumbbells. I've got, you wanna go heavy when you can. We've got, uh, please make sure that you've you know, warmed up before. If you haven't warmed up, click that link right there. That's a warm up for you. And if you haven't looked at the exercises, look below, because we're going continuous. This is 30, 30 seconds, sorry, 30 minute continuous workout. All right, so <laughs> let's get on the floor with our glute bridge first. Yep, start with that. We're gonna start with the glute bridge. All right, 30 seconds, I've got the timer. So this is our first, this is more of a tri set than a drop set, but uh, you know, uh, we're gonna do three different versions of the, of the glute bridge in five, four, three, two, one, here we go. All right, so down the ground, and you're just gonna squeeze the glutes at the top. So we're thrusting our hips into the air, and then we're squeezing our glutes. So the reason why we're doing this is we're kind of getting that glute activation, right? Yeah, we wanna get those glutes working. That's right, because what happens is a lot of times when your glutes aren't fired up before, or at least activated, then you know your knees take the brunt of a lot of the lower exercise. Okay, now we're gonna add oh, alternating, alternating, alternating march. So stay in the glute bridge at the top, and then just move your knee towards your chest. Whew. Exhaling on the way up. Good. Whew. So again, a lot of people don't activate the glutes. I thought we thought we'd throw this in here yeah, to start thought, off this drop set. Yeah, put it first. Try to keep those that butt in the air. We're, now we're just moving, a little dynamic movement. Now we're gonna grab some weight. I'm gonna grab 25 pounds here and we're doing weighted glute bridge. Good. So try to bring those, what I want you to do is spread those knees out at the top of the movement. Push the knees out. Try to bring the heels close to your butt and squeeze at the top. I really want you to focus. Mind, muscle, connect and connect the glutes to your, feel the glutes, feel it. Good work, okay, 30 seconds, rest. We now gotta, for that one. You're gonna have to move fast. Yep. Cause now we've got rack squats are next, okay? So you're gonna move fast in between exercises. We got rack squats, goblet squats, bodyweight squats. Now the real drop sets start. Yeah, now the real drop sets start, exactly. Good. So I'm gonna use 25s for now. And again, it's just continuous. 30 seconds, 30 seconds, 30 seconds, and we get that rest. Here we go. So rack, I'm gonna rack. I'm gonna hang. Down, good. So. Remember, heels on the ground, knees pointed out, sitting back into the squat. Of course, I've got these racked, so my core is engaged, shoulders are engaged, chest is engaged, and just more quads. Okay, drop it for goblet squats. Well, I'm gonna go heavier with the goblet squat, actually. I'm gonna go 40. That may not have been a good idea. <laughs> but again, we're trying to build some muscle here while we're burning fat. So go heavy if you can, when you can. Good. Knees pointed out. Sit back when you can. Keep that dumbbell close to your body. Now body weight squats. Try to move faster here. Try to go deep if you can. Inhale on the way down, exhale on the way up. This is actually our workout today, so you were working out with us. 
Drive through those heels. Drive through those heels. Good. Squeeze the glutes. Good work. So that last exercise, because we're using body weight, you can move faster, right? All right. Next up, we've got stationary lunge, right side. Or choose a side where one foot's gonna be in front of the other. Yeah, pick a leg. We're gonna be holding two dumbbells. Getting that oxygen into the body. Got about three seconds. Here we go. Here we go. All right, so I'm gonna step with my left foot forward. Sorry, right foot forward, left foot back. And now you're just going down into that lunge and back up. I like to go down and come back. Some people just like to do like a pulse, but I want to get a full lunge in there. Try to keep that body tall or at least keep your back straight. Yes. It's okay if you're bending over slightly. Okay, good. Now we're going to drop the one in the inside, stay in that lunge, and you're going to keep going. So we're going to drop the, keep the one on the outside leg. Okay. Now you're gonna feel that. Try not to come out of the lunge. That's the goal. Okay. Oh. Woo. Wow. wow. That back leg, Oof. that black qu back quad. Just feeling it. I feel my front, my glutes. Yeah. So you're gonna feel it in different places depending on what's stronger. What's, okay, so reverse lunge. So step back with that left leg. So again, same position, but now we're going to that reverse. Ooh. Woo. Remember, focus on that technique as well. Don't just move through fast. If you have the right technique, body's tall, core's tight, pushing off with that front leg, man, you're gonna feel this. Oh yeah. Without even Look trying to go ahead. fast. Yeah. Look straight ahead. Keep that core tight so you don't bend over. Okay. Oh man. That was good. Lunges. Thank you. Thank you. Lunges are tough, man. Lunges are tough for me. Stationary lunges. I can jump lunge. I can do reverse lunge, forward lunge. It's the stationary lunge. <laughs> Everybody has one. Okay, this time I'm gonna try and do what you said, and not get out of the That's lunge. That's right. And if this is the second or third time you're doing this workout, go heavier. I always tell you, go heavier. You wanna build these quads, baby, and the glutes. Okay. And we wanna be athletic, okay? Other leg forward. Yes, now. other leg forward. So again, move at your own pace here. We wanna get good technique. I know I talk about that. And if, you're, if it hurts, hurts your knee a little bit, there could be a lot of things happening. Of course, right now my back knee, of course, is hurting a little bit because it's fatigued. Just a bit. You know, quads are tight. So that, Ooh. now just drop the inside. Okay. Stay in Ooh. that lunge if you can. <laughs> and now. On the toe. Oh, there we go. And you can go, you can stay nice and tall too. Oh, look forward, look at me, stare at me. Oh. Ah. Now don't look at me. And if you have to take a break, take that break. Remember, we've pre-exhausted the quads, the legs from the first set. Okay, let's go reverse lunge with the right, the right leg stepping back. Push off with that front leg. One side's gonna be better than the other. One side's gonna be stronger than the other. So right now, this knee's feeling it. And that's because my quads are totally toast. They're fatigued. When your quads are fatigued. I must say. You're gonna feel that in your knee more. Yes, dear. I feel this perfectly. Where you need to feel it. Where I need to feel it. Please. Good job. Doctors. Oof. All right, we're gonna do some RDLs. Dumbbell RDLs, R Romanian deadlifts. So I'm gonna use 15s, I'm not gonna go too heavy here, but guys, if you're a male, go heavy. If you can, we wanna get those glutes, right? Proper form. We wanna fire up those glutes, get those hammies. Uh, if you're a female, go heavy too. But you guys already do this a lot. I think women do this more than men. Men don't generally do RDLs. Okay. So if you're not a gym rat, okay, here we go. So remember, RDL, double, you're sitting back, knees are bent. You can go nice and slow, so you can feel it. Stick the butt back, hinge at the hips. A lot of people don't know what hinging at the hips are, so what I like to say is, put, point your butt 
to the back of the wall. Stick that butt out. Let the butt start the movement. Okay, don't start the movement with your upper body. Now let's go staggered. So step slightly back, same thing. And on the front leg, I want you to bring, straighten it at the top and squeeze the glutes. So straighten that front leg at the top and squeeze both glutes. Whoa. Oh, yeah. Right, you're gonna feel that. Keep the back straight. Don't round which, it back. Which means shoulders are back. Oh boy. Proud yeah. chest. Okay, step Switch. back with the other leg. Slight, remember, slight. Oh yeah. So the front leg's gonna bend and then you're gonna straighten at the top. Squeezing the glutes at the top. Don't lean back. Just squeeze your glutes. Yeah. I think that's a mistake a lot of people make. They... Yeah. And if you're getting feeling this in your lower back a little bit, bend the knees more. Bend the knees more. Whoa. Whew. This is uh, close to a stiff legged deadlift Ooh. as well. Wow. I'm already sweating like a, yep. like a banshee. <laughs> okay, we're doing shoulder presses. Oof. Double shoulder press, alternating shoulder press, and then single dumbbell shoulder press. Again, how do you make this tougher? You go heavier. I'll go slower. Or go slower, correct. Because we are doing about a minute and a half on the same muscle group. Yeah, so. I mean, so you'll get plenty of. You don't need to go heavy for it to. Yeah. Okay. So presses, oh geez, yeah. You can do a push press. You can hold the dumbbells like I'm holding them. Or you can hold them like Angela. Knee slightly bent if you're just doing a regular press. Yes, yeah, so you definitely wanna. Proud chest. Talk them through it, sister. And a little bit of a <laughs> pelvic tilt. Yep. Shoulders back. You guys are seeing me do this. You know that I don't have great shoulders, alternating, so. I do have to compensate a bit. So Angela, watch her do this exercise. You can pretty much obey the same rules when doing weightlifting. Proud chest, shoulders back, looking straight ahead, knees slightly bent. Those are pretty much with almost every exercise. All right, let's double chest. So single dumbbell, chest press right up. Or sorry. Shoulder press. Shoulder press. Straight up. So I'm keeping my elbows straight. Again, that's because of my shoulders. You can really make this hard if you just pull yeah. too. Double it up, go speed. Let's go for speed, guys. All right. Oh Let's my go gosh. for speed. Oh, go for speed. Squeeze the glutes too. Keeps that. Yes. Keeps your pillar. When I say pillar, we're talking stand up, honey. That's a pillar right here. You want to keep that nice and tight. Okay. We're down to bent over rows. Double bent over row, alternate bent over row, and then single dumbbell row. So here you can definitely go heavier. 40s, maybe even 50s. I absolutely love these styles of workouts. Honey. Yeah, they're, they're awesome, man. So good. They're awesome, one, the, one after the other, total body. Here we go. We're getting all the functional movements, hinge, pull, push, squat, lunge, core. Now this exercise, here, you know. same thing, I'm keeping chest out, yeah. shoulders back, Yeah. my neck is in line with my spine, I'm not looking up, just looking at the floor. Roll by your, he by your hips, core's got to be tight though, uh, alternating. Now I'm going to do deads, deads, right here, boom, so Ooh. we're picking it up from the middle, boom, uh. I'm picking mine up from the middle. Okay, I want to switch to that, Ooh, that's so good. Rowing it inside my leg. Ah, just hitting another variation of the row. But you gotta make sure the back's straight. And you gotta sit down a little bit yeah. more. Good. Exhale on the way up. Single dumbbell. You do the uh, landmine, honey. Here we go, let's yes. go, let's go, let's go. 30 seconds. So I just got a landmine grip. Like she's actually using the landmine. I'm holding the dumbbells. Oh, 
at the side. Bend those uh, knees if you have to a little more. Yeah. If you have to. Yeah. Uh, oh. Keep that neck Ooh. and head Time. Oh. in line. Oh that my God. sucked. That sucked. Okay, on the ground, lying chest press. Wow. We're going single, alternating, and then single I'm chest gonna press. Try. I'm gonna try 40s. 30s. We're gonna go 40s to start. And then keep these 25s close by. Get those dumbbells ready because you're gonna be lying down. Oh. You can hear my breathing. I mean, this is pretty tough. All right. Dumbbell press, chest press. Remember, we're gonna be doing this for about a minute and a half, so go at a good pace, specifically if you're going heavy. I got 45s. Let's see how long I can last with this. Actually, these are 40s. I got 30s. Good. Inhale on the way down, exhale on the way up. Get that oxygen into the body. Okay, alternating. Okay. You can alternate from the bottom or from the top. I'm going to the top. Oh my gosh. So we're showing you different ways. Oh, jeez. This is so hard. I know. Push. Work through it. Let's go. Really killing that chest. All right, single chest. Take one dumbbell and press straight up. Okay. Oh, I can't even do that. Straight up. There we go. But bring it down to your chest. Don't bring it down to your belly button. That's a different exercise. Oh my God. I might change my grip on this. I may even do it this way. Yeah. Just because I'm yeah. sweaty. You too. Yeah, and I didn't this. want it to oh. fall on my face. <laughs> Oh man, that was brutal. That was brutal. Can you still hear me? Yes, you can. All right, double curls. Jeez, double dumbbell curls. I can't even get up now. I'm gonna try like literally going heavy on this one because I, oh, wow, I really? want big biceps. You got what? I love big biceps, so. Yeah, man, for sure. Try. You want 20s? 20s. Shit. Okay, I'm gonna. 20s is, is light if you're just doing like eight to 10 reps or whatever, but. We're gonna go double. Curls, curls. Oh, you already got curls. Yeah, curls. Okay, 35s. Oh, geez. Let's go. Remember what I said. Again, this applies again. Proud chest. Yeah, shoulders, shoulders back. Shoulders back. Knees slightly bent. Squeeze the glutes. Oh yeah, the squeezing of the glutes. Okay, right. alternate. Singles. Breathe out. Good. Yeah. Ooh. I'm gonna Just drop Squeezing those glutes. And get some good reps. You doing a drop set and the drop set? I'm doing a drop set and a drop set. Holy free moly. One down? Yeah. One. Oh my god. Oh. Alright, feet together. Yep. Please let me bend. Burn, baby. Oh my gosh. You're doing sets of three. Oh my gosh. Well, since we're only doing biceps this one time, I'm gonna keep it. I wanna try. Oh man. To work through it. All right, we've got single. Oh Jesus! Right side snatches. Oh my gosh! Right side snatch to clean and press to cleans. Now you can do muscle snatches where you just muscle it up, or you can do explosive snatches. I'm not sure what I'm going to do next. I think I'm going to do. Because I'm not sure what I got from the floor. Power definitely snatch. from the floor. You're powering, I may muscle it up, which means just like this. So I'm not jumping, I'm muscling this up. And it's got the right snatch to sneak technique. Nice and 
Nice pause at the top. Control it on the way down. Oh. You're telling that snatch. Yeah. I got some. Clean and press. Let it go side? a little bit lighter, yeah. Feel fine. Okay. Am I gonna try the 30s? Clean, press. Clean, press. Oh my gosh. Clean, press. Keep the elbows tight and clean. Okay. Squeeze the glutes during the press. Press away from the floor, good. Just cleans now. How did I drop it? Just cleans. Right side. So it's almost like a curl. I put these together because we just curled, so you're gonna feel a bit of fatigue. So you better use the lower body, yeah. Guys, your bicep should be done. Yeah, I can't even curl this up if I ask, if I try to. Nope. I gotta clean it. Rest. So during that whole process, I switched weights. I went from 35, then for a clean and press, I went lighter because of my shoulder. You guys don't do that. I try not to. Yeah, I mean, if you have to go down, you have to go down. Yeah. But. So I'm gonna muscle mine up again, which means I'm just gonna pull from the ground and you're gonna explode, right? Left side, guys, other, or other left side. Left side, yeah. Left side, left side, left side. Oh man, how are you guys doing out there? Power, use the legs. You're doing explosive? Yeah, <sighs> still use the legs on the... Keep that core tight. Squeeze the glutes at the top. That's gonna protect your pillar. Everything's tight at the top. Everything. Yeah. Yeah. Control it. Good. Good. All right. Clean and press. Oh man. Might have to be a push press there. Yeah. Oh, I could go probably heavier here. Clean, press. Clean. I'm using. A you got the 30s, huh? 30 here. But it's, not, it's not the prettiest. Clean. Also, elbows tight. A little pause. A little hip hinge, a little at the top. hinge Basically, to explode. Yeah. Basically, I like to pause because the core has to stabilize everything on that pause. <coughs> wow. Okay, tricep oh, presses. No. Tricep presses, this is the one that's... This one's gonna kill. Yeah. So now, we're gonna press up, like this, from the below. So your elbows are gonna be by your belly button, and you're gonna press up. Not up by your head, but up, straight up. That's gonna hit the triceps. Oh, man. I'm gonna try? Guys, leave some comments below. Let us know how this is going for you. Well, if you're watching, what you're gonna do when this workout comes for you. <laughs> what you gonna do when the funks are in Angela come for you? Nice down low. I could definitely go heavier here, but I'm not gonna say that right now. Well, the triceps. Because the triceps are a small muscle. When they fatigue. They're gone. They're done. But they're the biggest muscle in the arm, so if you want big arms, you gotta, oh, okay, this is the one. Alternating. Okay. Come to the bottom. I'm gonna alternate this way, okay. press. Press. Remember, pressing not straight over your head, but straight up. So your elbows should be by your, at the same level as you, almost your belly button, depending on how. And then you're gonna press out, up, away from your chest. Oh, and squeeze the triceps to the top. Oh, oh my God. Now you're gonna take one dumbbell okay. and do skull crushers over your head. I can't even. <laughs> I couldn't bend my arm there. You're gonna do skull crushers over your head. These round doubles are the worst. This might be a, oh my God, a real skull crusher. Yeah, this may actually crush it my was, skull. So 
<laughs> oh, I can't even hold that freaking dumbbell. Time, okay. We got two more, three more drop sets. Jesus, man. <laughs> All Who right. made this workout? This is a tri set now. We're gonna do three shoulder raise variations. Bent over raise, side lateral raises, and front raise. So bent over raise first. Not these ones? No, I'm gonna go with the okay. tens, I think. No, 15s. I'm just walking around here. You're walking around aimlessly? Aimlessly. I'm trying to go a little heavier, actually. Cause my, oh yeah, I should've went with that. So, I got mine a little bit different. Hits that rear delt. I'm doing palms facing each other. Yeah, I'm doing palms facing me. I'm pausing at the bottom, just to ensure. Oh, get nice and low. Oh. Exhale on the way up. Oh. Now we're doing side lateral raises. Oh my god. I'm lightheaded here. Angela, lead the way for the good people. Again. Oh. Shoulders. Check the technique. Proud chest. Yep. Shoulders back. Oh. Knees bent. Depending on how heavy you went yeah. during all those other exercises. By the time you get here, you'll be like, funk. I'm feeling it. How come I can barely I'm gonna go, down. go front? And you can see that through this workout, you do, a, you do it a few times. You can switch it up. You can do this yeah. way. This yeah. way. Yeah. This way. If it's really light. Two at a time. Pick up heavier ones. You gotta make sure Glider. that you're challenged. Yeah. So. All right, next up, alternating meet the queens. Okay. Dumbbells to the side. Oh my gosh. Then we're gonna do goblet meet the queens, and then we're gonna do body weight meet the queens. So the first one is regular, racked? Yeah, regular. Double racked? Not racked, just Hanging? to the side, yeah. Okay. Hanging to the side. Man. Oh. I'll save you, I got it, I got it. Good when you work out with a partner. I'm scared, actually. All right. Yeah, sorry. All right, I'm gonna move over here, if that's okay. Good. Okay, so meet the squeeze, step back lunges, really. So again, try to keep that body tall. Don't bend over too much. Now you're gonna feel this in the adductors, the abductors, but the glutes. Remember what we started this workout with? Glutes. <laughs> All right, goblet. Alternating. Meet the queens. Same exercise. Just hold one dumbbell yeah. in the center. Now we got that core and extra. We core. don't generally move this way. Jeez. On the core. Oh, I gotta use this entire gym. Push off with that front leg. Trying to let that knee buckle. Nice and low if you can. Oh. Now just body weight. There you go. Nice and low. Nice and low. Yeah. Andrew's got a great technique here. Push off with that front leg. Push this leg. Push. Yep. All right, final three exercises. Now listen. Oh no. You're just gonna do the best you can. Regular push up, diamond push up, wide push up. Uh, do the best you can. Okay, that's it. Dex, do you may, not put the camera on me. You may only get two or three. <laughs> you may only get one. Heck, you may get all. I don't know how many you're gonna do, but how I'm gonna do them regular? Regular first. Here we go. I'm gonna bust out five more times. Oh, God. 
Do not go on your knees, whatever you do. Now we're doing a close grip. <laughs> Are you on your knees? <laughs> no. I mean, don't do it. Push it right. Close we grip. Know. We know, oh. we know. How many oh. will I get here? Oh. Oh. One. Six. Oh my God. Two. That's it. Good job. Three. Oh. Four. Oh. My triceps. Oh. Shoulders. Okay. Wide now, wide. Now one time, time. Good job, everybody. Good work, honey. Let's breathe for a second. Get your breath. Slow that heart rate down. Good work, everyone. Man, look at this. We're soaking wet. We got some muscle going here. There's a double biceps. Thank you so much for joining us. Now, a few things here. Make sure you get some water. Make sure that you towel down. If there's an ab workout you wanna do, do an ab workout. If you need a post-workout stretch, click that link right there. So important to stretch after these workouts. And listen, tomorrow, you're gonna do a recovery routine, okay? Mobility, yoga, you're not gonna work out again. This is all about saving our bodies so we can do this the next time. Also giving our muscles a chance to grow, get stronger and get bigger. Thank you so much, guys. I love you so much. You guys are amazing. If you're on YouTube watching this, like, share, comment. Let me know how you did, and we will see you in that next workout. Get it done. Hey, it's Funk Roberts here, and thank you so much for watching that video. I hope you liked it. In fact, I hope you loved it, and I hope you learned something from that video. Please show me some love and like this, share this, leave your comments below because you know I love that, those comments, and if you like that workout, click that button right there, and I'll take you to the next workout. I'm the Funkster, and I'll see you on the other side. Get it done. Ah.